I'm so used to seeing Dino when I hear that health music. All right, in HealthWorks this morning, summer is right around the corner, and that means it's time to break out those shorts and bathing suits. Registered dietitian Gail Posner is here with us this morning. It's Posner, right? Posner. Posner, Posner. God, I knew I'd mess it up. All right, so let's talk a little bit, Gail. First of all, when I hear registered dietitian, I get very nervous. Oh, oh no, I'm going to change that right now. No, because dietitians are no fun. No, I come up with solutions for people that are trying to lose weight, and they say, I just can't lose weight. Mm -hmm. They come to my office, and I look at their diet. They write down what they eat for three days, and I figure out what errors they're making. And today, I'm going to share some of the most common errors. All right. So people will be ready and looking great. Okay, good. So one... You can't go on a weight loss diet if you're hungry. So you got to stay hydrated. Right. A lot of us confuse hunger and thirst. Mm -hmm. And so I say, drink water, drink water. Oh, I'm so tired of water. I can't get that much water in. A brand new product on the market, you can taste it, yep. is vitamin water 10. Only okay. 10 calories per 8-ounce serving. So there's just 10 calories in this. Well, this is a 20-ounce serving. So this, so, so this is 20 for the whole calories. bottle. Yep. Okay, what's brand new about it is it's a different type of sweetener in it. We're tastes like tang. That. Remember tang? Sure. I like that. Sure. It's good. So my clients that don't want to do the diet artificial uh, sugars mm -hmm. are really liking this. It comes in four flavors. Okay. I plan on having lots of it during the summer when people are over for the bathing suits and swimming. All right, so vitamin water 10. Very no good. artificial colors or flavors. So gotcha. we're excited about that. All right. All right, so then people come in and say, but I eat really healthy and I am not overeating. So foods like these are tart cherries, mm -hmm. so healthy for you, filled with antioxidants, you know, just wonderful for your health. Or things like almonds. I love cherries. Right. Okay, Delicious. so you just broke the rule. Well, yeah, I broke the rule. They're <laughs> cherries. They're natural. They're good for you. Exactly. Or the almonds. Um, mindful eating. Mm -hmm. Grazers. People are walking by, opening their cupboards, cupboards, grabbing a handful of this, grabbing a handful of that. These are calories they're not aware of. So I encourage people, maybe the behavior they'll work on for this week is either the getting enough fluid in okay. or mindful eating, only eating sitting. Okay. Okay, want to do one more? Yes. Okay, I have several, but we're going to do one more. Why don't you pour yourself a bowl of cereal? Well, I'll start by telling you this. I would never eat a bowl of cereal out of this bowl in a million years. And I even brought two bowls. Not because, because it's not decorative, because it's not big enough. <laughs> <laughs> that is the point. Okay. Okay. So pour myself a bowl. Yeah, what is the portion what of cereal you, you're going to pour? Yeah, what are you thinking with this bowl? <laughs> How am I going to eat cereal out of this? Okay, so the point is, is this is not the three-quarter of a cup serving, Jay, that it says on the back of the bowl. Yo, I'm going to eyeball that and say that's about a, well, that's a really, that's about a two and a half cup serving. This is 110 calories, you, three quarters of a cup serving. One, please. You are out of your mind. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I so, love you, Gail. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I do it to be funny, but really, you know, if you maybe, expect me to have this for cereal and for breakfast in the morning, I don't know if I can do that. Well, I would expect that you'd have a slightly larger breakfast. You're a little bit taller than me. So, um, Taller is the key yeah. word. <laughs> Good. Okay. So you might have a bigger portion than that, but we also got to save some calories for the milk and the fruit that go. Well, out. I do skim milk. Is that good? That's good. All right. Or here's a clever solution. Why not eat your cereal out of a, a bowl or a mug that you just can't pour a big enough serving in? Okay. So this will limit you. Find the perfect bowl in your house. And the other thing is, as you're pouring the cereal bowl, put that back in the cupboard because so many people pour that second bowl. Oh, I was. The, the paper to bowl ratio has to be right there. So wait a minute, so, just so I know, hold on a minute. So it's 110 calories for this? Yeah. So this is what, like 400 calories? Uh, about that. Wow. You got it. <laughs> oh, and another Those trick. Those deceitful cereal people. Um, which yeah. I don't even need, I know the answer. Oh, come on. <laughs> I will tell you this, though. No, you don't know the answer. I don't like a big spoon. I like a little spoon. <gasps> And which is great. Yeah. So maybe some of the viewers out there will switch to the smaller spoon. Slow yourself down. If we eat really fast, you're not going to be satisfied, and you're going to go for that, that second bowl. Gail, everything you said makes great sense. Are you going to apply any? No one likes you. No, I'm oh, just kidding. I'm kidding. No, that. you're awesome. You're great. <laughs> Thank you. And those are really good tips to know. All right, so for more information, we'll get this information up on our website, myfoxdetroit.com. Smaller, smaller portions, Q. Yep. I believe in that, and also count your almonds. 24 is a serving. Well, Kid Rock performs shows in Metro Detroit all the time, but this summer he's taking on a new venue.